What's up, everybody? Chuck the Biz back with you to do another little review. And again, I have a product from Sam and Oliver's Hot Sauce Company. I'm getting this guy out there as much as I can because he's got it going on. I keep telling him, Jeff, stop messing around, bro. Stop trying to make it better because it's going to be very hard to make it better. Package it and start selling it. Because let me tell you what, everything I've had of just is that good. Sam and Oliver's Hot Sauce Company, right there. You can find them right there. And then what we have today is we have an unlabeled, untested, mustard based barbecue sauce. So, Jeff's got me some, uh, a new revised batch and chocolate sauce is coming in the mail. It's, he says he's trying to make it better, and I, like I said, the one I had, I can't, I don't know how I, it can be any better. So, tell me go ahead and try these barbecue sauces. So, hear that? So, what we're going to have here is a brand new barbecue sauce. I can smell the mustard. I can smell the ketchup. I can smell the molasses. Maybe I think I'm smelling some garlic. Definitely a mustard based sauce. Wow, it smells dynamite. It, re it really does smell really good. So what we have here, I got, I got some pork that I'm gonna try this on. And I'm getting the real heavy mustard, light, light, light smell of vinegar maybe. Got a nice brown looking sauce. You can see the consistency of the pour. And I'm gonna bring this in and let you see what it looks like. And there it is. Obviously, you can see there's some black pepper in there. It's got a nice, nice, nice smooth, real smooth looking uh, texture to it. So that's what I'm bringing. This is Jeff McGinnis's. As of right now, it's an unnamed barbecue sauce. Like I said, this guy is up and coming. And let me tell you something, man. You guys better watch out because Jeff's for sure not playing around because his flavor profiles are on jam. So, um, yeah. If I were you guys, start keeping track of this guy. Jeff McGinnis Sam and Oliver's Hot Sauce Company with their unknown mustard-based barbecue sauce. Wow. Okay, up front you get the, up front you get straight up you get the mustard, so you know it's a mustard base. You get the little twang of the vinegar, but the vinegar is not overpowering in this barbecue sauce. If there's peppers in here, I can't taste the heat. It's almost like there is a little bit of heat in here, but then again, that could just be the black pepper. I'm not tasting a lot of a lot of a lot of a lot of pepper in here. Chili pepper that is. What I am tasting is the mustard, the twang of the vinegar. Very good. I would suggest that this be a good dipping sauce. Like I said, I don't I don't even know what's in this. 
which I'll probably get a hold of Jeff and put all the ingredients down in the description so everybody knows what this is. For being a mustard base, dynamite. I'm telling you, I have not had one bad thing that he sent me. Like, seriously, it's on, it's on jam, bro. Seriously. This is a very tasty, um, off the, off the regular profile barbecue sauce. Being the mustard base. It's like you want to keep eating it, and you want to keep eating it. So I'm telling you, man, you guys better watch it. You better watch out, because Jeff's coming. And he's coming fast. This 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 barbecue sauce is is ranking up there with with with, with some of the tops. I still don't quite outdo the Motor City. Motor City, I'm telling you, man, by far is 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 the tops in my book for barbecue sauce. Who's your daddy? That has a has a very a very good uh, uh, ranking up there with me as well. You know, and, and I'm really liking what you guys are doing out there with these sauces, and you know, because like, anybody can go in the store and buy a uh, Sweet Baby Ray's and, you know, KC Masterpiece, and man, but you got something like this, man, you got, you got something. I really like the profile of this sauce. Would I recommend this sauce? Most definitely. This sauce is almost lick your plate clean type sauce. So hopefully Jeff's gonna Jeff's gonna get the scoop on this and uh, and start ma and market it market it this as well as as his hot sauces. Cause man, seriously Jeff, stop messing around, bro. Get it out there and get, get start making your money. This the, this sauce right here definitely sellable, one hundred percent. Don't change nothing. Don't do nothing different. Put a label on this and get it out there. Like I said, you got the mustard base. You got the vinegar to twang. You know, you got the black pepper in it. You're gonna, there's just some garlic in it, probably some onion. And, you know, I don't know what else to say. Another good product from Jeff McGinnis. So, I'm going to leave it at that in this video. Say thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you next time.